Hold on tight folks, we're about to dive into the exhilarating world of personal finance. Now I know what you're thinking. Personal finance? Exhilarating really? Well yes. You see personal finance isn't just about numbers and bank statements. It's about dreams, goals, and the freedom to live life on your own terms. It's about harnessing the power of your hard-earned money to carve out the future you desire. This video is your comprehensive guide to understanding personal finance, its scope, and its significance in your life. We'll cover everything from budgeting to investing, from managing debts to planning for retirement. We'll empower you with the knowledge to make informed financial decisions and achieve financial well-being. So forget everything you thought you knew about personal finance. We're about to make it fun, engaging, and most importantly, relevant to you. So buckle up as we take a thrilling ride through the world of personal finance. Personal finance? Sounds complicated, right? Well, fear not, we're about to break it down for you. So, what's personal finance? Picture this. You're the king or queen of your own financial kingdom. Everything that comes in and goes out, all the gold in your treasury, every investment in your realm, it's all under your control. That's personal finance. It's about managing your financial resources to reach your life goals. And trust me, it covers a lot of ground. Think of it as a giant umbrella, covering all the financial reins of life. First off, we have budgeting. It's your roadmap, showing you where your money's coming from, where it's going, and where you can cut back to save for that crown jewel you've been eyeing. Then there's saving. It's all about putting aside a chunk of your coins for rainy days or for those big ticket items in your future. Investing is next on the list. That's how you grow your wealth. It's about putting your money to work in the stock market, real estate, or other ventures. Then we come to debt management. Now nobody likes owing money, but sometimes it's necessary. The trick is managing it wisely to keep your kingdom running smoothly. Last, but certainly not least, is retirement planning. That's about securing a comfortable life when you're ready to hang up your crown and enjoy the fruits of your labor. So, personal finance is basically your own little financial kingdom and you, my friend, are the king or queen. And if you're enjoying this royal treatment, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more financial wisdom. Now what's a kingdom without a plan? Let's talk about budgeting and financial planning. Imagine your income is a pie. Now who doesn't love pie? But this pie isn't for eating, it's for dividing. Budgeting is essentially slicing your income pie into various portions for your daily expenses, your savings, your investments, and your rainy day fund. It's about knowing where your money goes and ensuring it goes where you want it to. Think of budgeting as your personal financial GPS. It helps you navigate your way to your financial destinations, be they a new car, a dream vacation, or simply a stress-free retirement. It's about being in control of your finances, rather than letting your finances control you. Now, on to financial planning. If budgeting is the GPS, then financial planning is the journey itself. It's about setting financial goals, both short-term and long-term, and creating a roadmap to achieve them. Want to buy a house in five years? That's a financial goal. Want to retire at 60 with a comfortable nest egg? That's another financial goal. Here's where the fun part comes in. Strategizing. Think of it as playing a real-life game of chess with your finances. It's about making smart moves and decisions that will help you achieve your financial goals. For instance, you might decide to cut back on dining out to save for a down payment on a house, or you might choose to invest in a mutual fund for your retirement. Creating a budget and a financial plan might sound daunting, but it doesn't have to be. Start with small, manageable steps. Track your income and expenses. Identify your financial goals. Make a plan to achieve them. And most importantly, stick to your plan. Remember it's okay to make adjustments along the way. Life happens, and your financial plan should be flexible enough to accommodate changes. The important thing is to keep your eyes on the prize and stay the course. Remember, a goal without a plan is just a wish, so start planning and stop wishing. So you've got a plan, great! But how do you build your financial fortress? Let's talk about saving and investing. Imagine this, you're a squirrel and winter is coming, you've got to gather and stash away as many acorns as you can, that's saving. Now, imagine you're a magical squirrel and every acorn you stash away turns into two, three or even more acorns over time, that's investing. Saving is the foundation of your financial fortress. It's the strong, sturdy walls that protect you from unexpected storms, like an emergency car repair or a sudden job loss. It's about setting aside a portion of your income regularly, no matter how small to build an emergency fund, achieve your financial goals, and attain financial security. But let's not stop at saving. Let's make our money work for us. That's where investing comes into play. It's like planting a seed and watching it grow over time. 
We're talking about wealth accumulation and long-term financial growth. Stocks, bonds, mutual funds, retirement accounts, these are all different vehicles you can use to grow your wealth. Investing is not a get-rich-quick scheme though. It requires a strategy, patience, and a bit of risk management. It's about understanding your financial goals, your risk tolerance, and the time you have to achieve those goals. It's about diversification, or not putting all your eggs, or in this case, acorns, in one basket. And let's not forget about the power of compounding interest. It's like a snowball rolling down a hill, getting bigger and bigger over time. The earlier you start investing, the more time your money has to grow. So remember, be a squirrel. Gather your acorns and stash them away. But don't just let them sit there. Plant them, care for them, and watch them multiply. So, start saving, start investing, and let your money work for you. Debt. The big bad wolf of personal finance. But don't worry, we've got some tricks up our sleeve. Let's dive into the murky waters of debt and credit, shall we? Debt can have quite the impact on personal finances, kind of like a boulder in your backpack. It can weigh you down, slow your progress, and if not managed properly, can lead to financial strain. That's why managing debt responsibly is so crucial. It's like learning to carry that boulder without breaking your back, or better yet, chipping it away piece by piece until it's just a pebble. Now, there are several strategies for debt repayment. Imagine debt as a mountain you need to climb. Some prefer the debt snowball method, where you start with the smallest debts and work your way up. It's like climbing the mountain from the base, one step at a time. Then there's the debt avalanche method, where you tackle the highest interest debts first. That's like taking a helicopter to the top of the mountain and working your way down. But remember, managing debt isn't just about repayment. It's also about understanding credit. Think of credit as your financial reputation. It's what lenders look at to determine whether they'll lend you money and at what interest rate. Improving your credit score and maintaining healthy credit habits can be as simple as paying your bills on time, not maxing out your credit cards, and not applying for new credit too often. Navigating the world of credit cards, loans, and other forms of debt can be like trying to find your way through a maze. But with the right knowledge and strategies, you can find your way out. It's about understanding the terms, knowing the risks, and making informed decisions. Remember, managing debt is like taming a wild beast. It may be tough, but it's not impossible. With the right tools and strategies, you can take control of your debt, improve your credit, and continue your journey towards financial freedom. So, ready to tame that beast? Now, let's take a look into the crystal ball and talk about the future retirement and future goals. It's like planning a vacation, but this one is a bit longer and you won't be sending any postcards. Retirement planning, folks, is not just for the silver-haired. It's about securing financial independence and maintaining quality of life in your golden years. It's like building a cozy nest feather by feather for a comfy long rest. So, how do we build this nest? Well, there are strategies for retirement saving that can make this task less daunting. Think of employer-sponsored retirement plans, individual retirement accounts, or as the cool kids call them, IRAs, and other retirement vehicles. They're like your financial GPS, guiding you towards your retirement destination. And it's not just about retirement, there are other future financial goals to consider. You might be dreaming about owning a house, funding your child's education, or leaving a legacy. It's about turning those dreams into achievable goals and setting a path to reach them. Remember, the key to success is starting early and being consistent. Just like a marathon, it's not about speed, it's about endurance. So start planning for your future today because the future is closer than you think. Well folks, we've reached the end of our thrilling ride through the world of personal finance. We've navigated through budgeting, saving, investing, managing debt, and planning for retirement. But remember, this is only the beginning of your journey. If you found this video helpful, show us some love by hitting the like button. It helps us understand what content you enjoy and want more of. And if you're interested in continuing this journey with us, consider subscribing to our channel. We have a plethora of fun and informative videos on personal finance waiting for you. We aim to make finance easy and accessible for everyone, and we'd be thrilled to have you on board. Remember, every like and subscribe helps us bring more of these videos to you. So, hit that like button, smash that subscribe, and let's continue this journey together. Your financial future is in your hands, and we're here to guide you every step of the way.